Meanwhile, electric bills are skyrocketing, and a lot of folks are understandably pretty upset about this. This afternoon, we have some answers from Eversource and state lawmakers. We have team coverage now, starting with Channel 3's Susan Raff, and Susan is here to give us the latest. I know a lot of sticker shock when people are opening their bills. There are, and we're not talking just a few dollars. We're talking about, in some cases, more than $100, so it is a big deal, and people need to know what's going on out there. So there's no question that people are upset. The question is, what can be done about it? Now, Republican lawmakers are calling for a special session. They want to use some of the state's surplus to give ratepayers some relief. In the meantime, lots of questions are being raised as to why our electric bills are so high. Some of it has to do with helping people during the pandemic pay their electric bills. We are paying to help those who couldn't pay their electric bills. But Eversource says that's not the main reason the costs are going up. The largest driver of the public benefits change this July are for state mandated uh, clean energy contracts that the utilities were required to enter into. And in some years, those have produced a significant benefit for customers that customers saw as a reduction to their bill. But in other years, there, there comes a cost. Um, so that has nothing to do with COVID policy. That is, is entirely separate. Now, a contract that was approved by lawmakers on a bipartisan basis to keep Millstone up and running was approved about five years ago. About 80% of the increase comes from those clean energy contracts. Now, lawmakers, lawmakers argue that some of those costs could have been phased out last year or phased in last year, but they say state regulators delayed paying for that contract, and now everything is coming up at once. Now, tonight at 5, could there be a special session, and could there be some relief. Live in the studio, Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. I'm Chief